don't know it was described in the newspapers. It's a simple Quaker um, American ceremony, and uh, I liked it for its for its simplicity and uh, <coughs> the deep feeling. The architectural field. Do you think that she would be able to assist you in any way? Uh, I haven't uh, examined her qualifications in that <laughs> respect. <laughs> it wasn't the object of <laughs> uh, and all the shared of an artistic nature is painting of Easter eggs. <laughs> Can you, uh, in any way, describe your courtship? Did you uh, go racing across the desert on horseback? Uh, did you go rabbit hunting? Uh, or did you just stand around and hold hands? Um, we didn't go rabbit hunting. Your <laughs> 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 uh, <coughs> ideals and ideals and and uh, a natural, immediate natural affection was the basis for it. I think it didn't have to require a lot of outside <coughs> accessories. Do you have any? Will your marriage in any way change your uh, <coughs> professional future? I don't anticipate that it will, no. You intend remaining on as chief architect at uh, Taliesin? Oh, definitely. Yes. You don't intend to establish an office someplace else and conquer new worlds? Certainly not. This is the, this is the, this, in my estimation, this is the greatest center and the center line of architectural and artistic and cultural thought of the nation of not the world and I wouldn't think of being any place else. We regard this as a Svetlana is coming here as a reinforcement of the of the tradition and the strength of Taliesin in the world, not a in any way a departure from it or I think that the Taliesin and the Old Valley here, as well as the the state and the United and the country, are enriched by the presence of a person like that here in the country who has <coughs> made such a strong affirmation on the on behalf of the ideals which we at Taliesin and which in the United the entire United States professes that this is outstanding. Anyone else? What's been the reaction of your colleagues here at Taliesin? Uh, it's been overwhelmingly full of friendship and love, and, and uh, we've had the <coughs> Taliesin Fellowship, and the, frankly, every, everyone here has just been marvelous in setting up the ceremony yesterday and doing everything to <coughs> make our life here much more much happy and successful. I think everyone here, Taliesin, I think everyone here uh, immediately accepted Svetlana as a person who was in her natural environment here, in a sense. Have you noticed any change in the attitude of your students toward you? No, I can't say that I have. Mm -hmm. Peter, so, did any friends of yours come out from the East for the ceremony? Or was there no time? Was it done so quickly? Uh, only um, Mr. Alan Schwartz came, but he didn't know the reason why I Ask him to come before he came. I didn't really inform anybody. Is it possible, Mr. Peters, that you would reenact for those of us who are not here the kissing of the bride? 
as the, the end of the press conference? Well, I don't think that's, I don't really think that's necessary. I have no, certainly no reason to object to anything, except I think that's a rather private and personal matter. Yes, it's a very romantic thing with the American people, that's why I ask that. <coughs> This was rather sudden, wasn't it? I mean, had you been planning it for quite a while? No. Uh, as, as I said in the before, previously, uh, I just met my wife um, three weeks ago, and we certainly hadn't planned anything prior to that. Where did you meet? Here at Taliesin, at Taliesin West. Did you request the court to waive the three-day waiting period when you applied for your license? Uh, no. Yes. Um, I don't know. We weren't in, in involved in that. We just simply got, and got the license and got married. Then you will both continue to live and work here at Taliesin. Yes, that's true. Do you have any immediate plans for the future? Uh, no. We expect to stay here. We don't plan a trip uh, anyplace else immediately, but... Uh, plan to stay here and a lot of work to do at Taliesin. Mrs. Peters, what do you think of Arizona? I As like I like country. I like Arizona very much. It's warm, nice, dry climate. Uh, do you have uh, anything similar to this part of the country over in Russia? Yes, southern southern Russia, the, the Black Sea area probably reminds me a little bit. I see. All right. Well thank you. Thank, thank you very much.